Hey guys, it's the Aussie Opals here, well, a few of us anyway. I'm Kayla. Katie. Steph. Tolo. Who has the best taste in music? Katie. Katie. Oh, oh, Liz. Liz is pretty yeah. cool. Oh, like yeah. when it comes to she's like, DJ. yeah, she's a DJ, but yeah, some of the dance music is a bit comfortable. Who is the best dancer? <gasps> Katie. Katie. Oh, oh Eddie no. as well. Eddie. 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 Steph, you're a pretty good dancer. I'm pretty good. Ah. <laughs> Steph, watch. <laughs> yeah. What inspires you? The Opal's legacy, that everyone that's come before us. Everyone's journey wearing the green and gold is different. So um, a lot of people, you know, have to work really hard and grind it out for years and years. And then finally, after you know years of trying to make a team, make their first team, and you know, a very select few get to just be in it. For us, like all of us sitting here, you know, we we're in Rio, and that's like the pinnacle. Like that's what you work hard for. That makes it all worth it. So that's you know, that feels really good. Who's the loudest on tour? <laughs> Kayla. <laughs> Easy. What is your favourite Olympic moment as a spectator, fan, or competitor? Captain Freeman. I was going to say, yeah, yeah, yeah definitely. By yeah, far. Especially being the Kai girl and yeah. I mean, Australian icon. Yeah. She's just amazing. Gives you goosebumps every oh, time so you watch so. it still. So, yeah, it's just going to go down history, I think. Yeah.